Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another episode. Today I'm traveling to Los Angeles, California, and this is state number six, so I'm excited to visit a new state, and also it's my first time going to the West Coast on this channel, so that's really exciting. And I'll be flying from Albuquerque to Los Angeles on Delta, and it's my second time flying Delta. I flew Delta to Atlanta, but this is gonna be a fun trip, and I hope you enjoy. Alright, I just checked in and I got my boarding pass. Now I'm gonna head to security. My flight starts boarding at 11.40, but I really don't need to rush there because I'm in Maine too, so I won't be boarding first, but uh, hopefully we'll board up quickly since it is a tiny plane and I'll see you at security. I just made it to gate B6. It is really busy in the airport today. It is full. The restaurants are full, which is great to see. It really shows how much travel is back now, but it is super busy, and this flight looks like it's a 100% full flight. So I'm going to be probably crammed in there because it's an E-175, but we'll see what happens. I'm so glad that I have TSA pre-checked because the line for general security was so long hundreds of passengers going through so it was super busy and it would have taken a long time but we are starting boarding they're doing pre-boarders right now and then they'll get to other boarding positions but as i said i'm in main two All right, I just made it on board and I forgot how tiny these E-175s are. It's really small in here because this is a regional jet, but it's going to be about an hour and a half. And I'm hoping to get really good views of the Grand Canyon because we'll be flying a little bit south of it. God, this plane is pretty tiny. I forgot because I'm used to flying on 737s and A321s. But I survived. Another thing, it is quite hot on board this plane. Luckily, they turned on the AC, so it's cooling down. And we're about to push back. The final people are boarding up, and it's a full flight. And my suitcase is in row 10, in the overhead bin, because there was no space back here. Because I'm in uh, 16D, so I had to put it up there. I don't really like doing that, because I like having my bag nearby. But that's what happens when you fly in these regional jets. <music> turbulent takeoff that was super super turbulent shaking all over the place because we were climbing through the clouds but now we are above them and it's smooth air right now clear skies up here so it's gonna be a nice ride hoping to get some views of the grand canyon also the lead flight attendant gave me these little cool pilot wings they were just passing them out to people who wanted them so i obviously wanted to take one really cool souvenir to take home from this delta flight <music> Flight attendant has started the onboard service. She's currently walking back. She's almost to my row, and I'll probably get a drink and a Biscoff cookie. But we just crossed into Arizona. Luckily, all of these clouds are going and breaking up. It's clear skies from here on. All right, they just finished the service and they picked up the trash. The Wi-Fi on board today is not working, so I couldn't get it to work on my phone. And right now, the views are great. Uh, that was the scenery that I was waiting for. I didn't see the Grand Canyon, but still saw mountains and our mountains and then the desert. But we are almost in Los Angeles. We'll be descending soon. And I'm hoping to see Palm Springs on the approach and the San Bernardino National Forest. It's getting a little bit bumpy, but it's still a really nice flight.
All right, welcome to sunny and warm Los Angeles, California. I'm down at baggage claim because I have to pick up and check the bag. Then I'm gonna head out to get my rental car, but it is nice and sunny here and it's 73 degrees. So really nice weather. All right, I am now here at the In-N-Out Burger on Spluvita, right next to LAX. And I just had lunch, now I'm plane spotting. And this is a location that is so famous for plane spotting. So I can't wait to see because the planes pass right there. When the next arrival comes, you'll be able to see it too. So if you're at LAX and you want to watch some planes or you're just interested, this is a great spot to come because there's so many people. Even like if you're on an aviation geek, it's so nice to have lunch, watch the planes. I saw Saudi coming all the way from Saudi Arabia, super cool. So it's just a nice spot to see some planes and have some lunch. Like I saw a few airline pilots coming to sit here and watch the planes. So lots of people are here. Alright, I made it to my hotel. I'm staying at the Westin Bonaventure here in downtown LA. What a day of plane spotting. That was an awesome two hours. Got to eat lunch and then saw all those planes, saw so many different heavies like British Airways, ANA, so many cool airlines and so many US airlines too, like Delta, American. I also saw an airline I wasn't expecting to see. It's called Lynx. It's a Canadian low cost carrier. Now I am checking in and then I'm going to head up to my room. Just made it up to my room. Have quite a bit of a city view. There's some buildings, not the whole LA skyline, but I am halfway up on the 17th floor and now I am getting hungry. So I'm going to go find something to eat soon and then call it a day. Here is the view. So of course not all of the skyline, but still can see some of the buildings. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed traveling from Albuquerque to Los Angeles on Delta and plane spotting at LAX. That was so much fun. Scenery on that flight was awesome. The approach and landing in Los Angeles was awesome. I had such a great time today. What a great start off to this trip. Make sure to like and subscribe and comment down below what you thought about today's vlog and stay tuned for upcoming vlogs because there's some epic stuff coming that you don't wanna miss and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. Real quick, I have a huge announcement. So as some of you may know, there's this platform called Epidemic Sound and the content creators on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, get their music from here, including myself. And right now they are doing an epic spring deal. If you sign up for a subscription using the link in the description, you'll get a 60 day free trial for the personal or commercial plans. So normally it's 30 days free, but now you get 60 days free. And this is only available until 11.59 p.m. on March 31st, Central European time. After that, this is gone. So make sure to get your subscription right now because if you've been wanting to get it, let's say you're a content creator or you wanna download these songs for yourself, now you can. 
This is only available to new users. If you're an existing user, you won't get the deal. Make sure to get that deal before it expires. Also, I'm so glad I had pre-check because the general security line was super busy. Hundreds of passengers trying to travel. Also, uh, the flight attendant. No.